Good morning, my brother, my sister. I want to welcome you all as you connect with this prayer this morning. God bless you, my sister. God bless you, my brother, as you connect all over the world. I know the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, has given you grace to continually participate in this prophetic prayer and fasting. I know God will continue to uphold you in the name of Jesus. Every desire of your heart, all that you are trusting God for, all that you are believing God for, I know the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, He will answer you in the name of Jesus. The Bible we say wait on the lord be of good courage and it shall strengthen thy heart wait i say on the lord psalm 27 verse 14 my sister my brother i know the god of special miracle it will visit you it will visit your life it will it will change your testimony in the name of jesus as you wait on the lord as you wait on the king of glory i know the lord will visit you there shall be a turnaround in your life in your family the bible say but those who wait on the lord shall renew their strength they shall mount up with wings like eagle they shall run and not be weary they shall walk in nothing isaiah 40 31 i say throughout this fasting period my brother my sister as you wait on the lord i say throughout this fasting period i know the king of glory the lord will strengthen you you shall not be weary you will not faint in the name of jesus i say you will not faint in the name of jesus the bible says, blessed is the man who listen to me watching daily at my gate waiting at the post of my door proverb 8 34 my brother my sister as you wait before the lord as you wait in prayer as you wait in fasting every desire of your heart i know the king of glory the lord of lord it will answer you the bible say blessed is that man blessed is that woman who listen to me watching daily at my gate waiting at the post of my door i said that will be your testimony you will be blessed because the god of special miracle it will answer your prayer it will answer your prayer i said the lord will answer your prayer the bible say lead me in your truth and teach me for you are the god of my salvation on you i wait all day psalm 25 verse 5 my brother my sister as you wait for the lord as you wait for the king of the glory as you wait for the ancient of days i know jehovah it will answer to every petition of your heart in the name of jesus the bible say i will strengthen the house of judah i will save the house of joseph i will bring them back because i will have mercy on them and they shall be as though i have not cast them out aside for i am the lord their god and i will hear them zachariah 10 6 i say my sister my brother the lord will strengthen you i say throughout these 21 days of fasting and prayer the king of glory the god that strengthened the house of judah i say may he strengthen you i say this morning the Lord will strengthen you the lord will strengthen you i said today the king of king will give strength to you in every area of your life the lord will strengthen you the bible say but may the god of all grace who call us to his eternal glory by christ jesus after you have suffered a well perfect and established strengthen and set to you first peter 5 10 i say as you wait i say throughout these 21 days of fasting and prayer my sister my brother i say the king of glory the god of eternal glory i say the god of glory it will give you grace i say the grace of god will sustain you i say it will sustain you it will perfect all that concerns you all that you are praying for the lord will establish the lord will set to you i say according to his word the king or king will say to you i say my brother my sister no matter the country of the world where you are connecting from in this fasting and prophetic period i say jehovah it will say to you i say it will say to you in the name of Jesus, you shall be set to the bible say i will strengthen them in the lord and they shall walk up on and down in his name says the lord zachariah 10 10 12 i say this morning the lord will strengthen you my sister the lord will strengthen you my brother i say you will not fail you will not fail the bible say i can do all things do christ who strengthen me philippians 4 13 my brother my sister that will be your testimony as you wait on the lord as you wait on the lord i said throughout these 21 prophetic days and journey i know the king of glory it will be your strength the lord will be your strength my brother my sister i want us to thank god somebody join me this morning i want you to give god the praise i want you to thank god for another beautiful day for what the lord is about to do what the god of special miracle god of extraordinary miracle what is about to do in your life i want us to give god the praise somebody thank jehovah i want us to thank the ancient of this the king of glory god that never fail god that never change god that remain the same i want us to give him glory and thank him this morning somebody join me the bible say and the heaven shall praise thy wonder he said oh lord thy faithfulness also in the congregation of the sin psalm 89 verse 5 i say somebody praise god this morning somebody celebrate their father give god their glory praise 
praise the name of Jehovah. Then the ancient of this God that never fail, God that never change. My sister, my brother, the Bible says, and the heaven shall praise thy wonder. I say, my brother, my sister, oh Lord, thy faithfulness also in the congregation of the saints. I say, somebody celebrate God in your life, celebrate God over your family, over your children. My sister, my brother, I want you to praise Jehovah, praise the King of Glory. I say, thank God for the grace He has given to you to have sustained you to see this thing. The Bible says, I will praise the Lord according to his righteousness i will sing praise to the name of the lord the most high psalm 7 verse 6 17 my brother my sister if i were you this morning i will give god the praise i will open my mouth and i will turn the ancient of them the bible says sing praise to the lord i wish you are in zion declare among the people is doing my sister my brother psalm 9 verse 11 i want you to offer to god the praise that due to the name of the jehovah the king of glory god that never fail the El Shaddai the Adonai. I want somebody to join me this morning. Celebrate the King of Glory. The Bible says, Make a joyful noise unto the Lord of the earth and make a loud noise and rejoice and sing praises. Psalm 8, 98, verse 4. My sister, my brother, I say, Sing joyfully wherever the country of the world we are. I want to thank God because the God of special miracle is about to visit your finances, visit your career, visit your business, visit your job, visit your marriage. I say, What? Whatever you are believing God for, I want you to thank God this morning. Somebody celebrate the Father. I say your academic work, the Lord is about to visit you in every area of your life. Whatever you are going through, my sister, my brother, I want you to make a joyful noise this morning. Somebody thank God. Thank God this morning. The Bible says, Now shall my head be lifted up above my enemy around about me. Therefore, I will offer in his tabernacle the sacrifice of joy. I will sing, yea, I will sing praise unto the lord psalm 27 verse 6 my brother my sister if i were you i will lift up my voice and i will thank god because the king of glory the god of special miracle is about to lift up your head above your enemy around the battle i say i want you to make a sacrifice of joy i say this morning somebody thank god thank the king of glory the bible say let them praise the name of the lord for his name alone is excellent his glory is above the earth and heaven Psalm 148 verse 13. My sister, my brother, I want you to join me this morning. Somebody celebrate the El Shaddai, the Adonai, the God that never lost a battle. I want you to thank him this morning. The God of special miracle. The God of extraordinary miracle. I say this morning, the specialist God is about to do wonders in your life this morning. My brother, my sister, I don't know what you are going through, but I know somebody. I know the King of glory, the God of special miracle that is about to visit you and turn around your situation in this fasting and praying period my sister my brother somebody thank god somebody celebrate jehovah thank god for the finished work of christ on the cross of covering what jesus had done for you and me somebody played the blood i said this morning somebody played the blood the bible said the blood shall be a sign for you on the houses where you are and when i see the blood i will pass over you the bible said no plague shall be befell you to destroy you he said when i strike the land of egypt exodus 12 13 my sister my brother i want you to join me this morning somebody play the blood of the lamb the precious blood of christ i want you to play the blood i say by faith somebody begin to sprinkle the blood over your children over your family over your career over your job over the heaven above you i say somebody play the blood the bible said to him to reconcile himself or all thing he said whether on earth or in heaven making peace by the blood of his cross colossians 1 20 my sister my brother i said somebody join me today i want you to apply the blood the bible said we overcame by the blood of the lamb and the word of our testimony revelation 12 11 and we do not love our life even unto death my sister my brother i want you to play the blood somebody saturate the heaven cover your household in the blood of jesus sanctify everything that concerns you your spirit your soul your body somebody sanctify by the blood the bible say in him we have redemption through his blood the forgiveness of our trespasses according to the riches of his grace my sister my brother there is a grace available for you in this fasting period Ephesians 1 7 my sister my brother if i were you i would plead the blood i will sanctify my spirit my soul in the blood of jesus my sister my brother 
the bible said for the life of the flesh is in the blood the bible said i have given it for you on the altar to make atonement for your soul so it is the blood that make atonement by the life leviticus 17 11 i said somebody play the blood the bible said indeed under the law almost everything is purified with the blood the bible said without the shedding of the blood there is no forgiveness of sin hebrew 9 22 my sister my brother i said somebody by faith this morning begin to connect yourself with the blood begin to connect your family in the blood connect that child in the blood connect your business in the blood that the god of special miracle may he touch you this morning i say somebody i want you to plead the blood the bible says so jesus also suffered outside the gate in order to sanctify the people i say through his own blood hebrew 13 12 my sister my brother if i were you this morning i will connect with the blood i say i will connect with the blood the blood of the lamb i said this morning i said this morning you are purified by the blood as many under the unction of this ministration i said this morning you are liberated by the blood of the cross you are delivered by the blood you are sanctified you are sanctified you are restored i said by the blood may the blood of jesus may he establish you may he validate you i said this morning and to all this fasting period i said may the blood of the lamb may he connect you may he legalize you may he vindicate you may he qualify you for special miracle i said the blood of jesus i said may he authorize you for special miracle may he qualify you may he position you for special miracle the blood of jesus may he fortify you may he sustain you i said throughout this 21 days and the rest of your life may the blood of the lamb may he empower you may he favor you he come my sister my brother i said may the blood the blood may he revive may he revive your situation in your life this morning my sister my brother i want us to pray somebody make a declaration i pray this morning i say may you be empowered the bible says in Acts 10 38 our god anointed jesus christ of nazareth with the holy ghost and with power we went about doing good healing all those who are sick and oppressed of the devil i said this morning my brother my sister i said be empowered somebody be empowered receive the power of the holy ghost i say as you go make the lord fortify you receive the fresh fire make the fire of the holy ghost may he rest upon you the fire that will connect you to special miracle that will position you for special miracle be empowered be empowered my sister my brother be empowered i said this morning somebody be empowered be empowered be empowered may the power rest upon you may he rest upon you the bible say in Acts 10 38 how god anointed jesus christ of nazareth with the holy spirit and with power who we went about doing good healing all those who are oppressed of the devil for god was with him i said today the power of god will rest upon you may he rest upon you may he rest upon you may he rest upon you the power of god that will terminate every persecution of the enemy in your life i say may he rest upon you the power of god of the holy spirit that will terminate every torment in your life may he empower you may he come upon you i say the power of god that will terminate every affliction in your life every disturbance of the enemy in your life i say may he rest upon you i say this morning receive that power 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 i say somebody be anointed be anointed be anointed may the power of god may he rest upon you the bible say and the angel answered and said to her the holy spirit will come upon you and the power of the eyes will overshadow you i said this morning may the epica iso the power of god may he dominate you may the epica iso the power of god may he overshadow you i said today may you be influenced by the epica iso the power of god may he prevail in every area every area of your life may he control may he have influence over every situation in your life i said may he overshadow you the power of god the epica is of heaven Lakabo Sete, 
pronto skai de penusia mi paka kala rahadia o santo rahande rokotoria e ya malara zati ya kabaranti me pronto skai de penukurianti brata kala ruska brata kala ruska made em paruska le rush e bradi gala zati skai de peluski pra adia pra anti kenukuriandi mazete kele rojate ya pra aligo la ruska pra anti the babu say casting all your anxiety on him because he cares for you my sister my brother as you cast your anxiety upon the lord i say today our prayer focus i say today day 14 of our fasting and prayer i know the king of glory the lord of lord the ancient of this is going to answer every petition of your heart the bible say whatever we ask we receive from him because we keep his commandment and do what pleases him first john 3 22 my brother my sister i say this morning i say the day 14 of our fasting and prayer i know the king of king the lord of lord it will answer every petition of your heart in the name of jesus I I say today our prayer focus is taken from second kings chapter 4 i say second Kings chapter 4 the bible told us very clearly and profoundly the bible says in second king in second kings chapter 4 the bible say now it happened one day that elisha went to shunem and the bible says where there was a notable woman the bible say and she persuaded him to eat some food so it was as soon as he passed by he would turn in there to eat some food the bible speak in verse 9 of second Kings chapter 4 the bible say when she said to her husband look now i know that this is a holy man of god who passed by us regularly my brother my sister i want to pray and i decree and declare over as many in this meeting as you are listening to this prayer i know jehovah we answer your prayer i know the king of glory when elisha went to shunem shunem is a place of double resting i say today may the king of king may he take you to your resting place i say today i say a place of comfort a to you in the name of jesus as you partake in these 21 days of fasting and prayer i pray that may jehovah god of double perfection i say may he perfect your life in the name of jesus i say today the day 14 of this fasting and prayer i know the king of glory it will take you to a place i say your own shoe name your place your place of rest your place of double rest in the name of jesus my sister my brother i said this morning the bible say the woman is a notable woman i pray that notable miracle shall be done in your life i say this thing i say may notable miracle extraordinary miracle may it be done in your life i say before the end of this 21 fasting and prayer my sister my brother as you connect with your faith as you connect with your faith I said today, may you see extraordinary miracle. May the King of glory, may the Lord of Lord, may He connect you with your breakthrough. I said the job you are praying for. I said the business you are praying for. I prophesy and I decree in the power of the Holy Ghost. I said, may you be connected. May you be connected. I said to your miracle, may you be connected. The Bible say now it happened one day that Elisha went to Shunem. I said, my sister, my brother. I said, may you connect. I say your double rest, your miracle, your breakthrough in the name of Jesus. May you be connected to him. May the Lord order your feet in the name of Jesus. I say where your job is. I say today, may the King of Glory, may he connect you. May he connect you. Markaba Shatea. This woman, she was connected to her apple of destiny. I pray for somebody. The Bible speaking verse 10. The Bible said, please, he said, let us make a smaller, a smaller upper room on the wall and let us put a bed I say for him there and a table and a chair and a lampstand so it will be whenever he come he can turn in there my brother my sister I say this morning this woman was connected to an epa of destiny I prophesy and I decree I say my sister my brother may Jehovah connect you may the king of glory may he connect you to your epa of destiny I say today I say what you will do the sacrifice you make I say that we connect you to your epa of destiny i said today may the lord lead you may jehovah lead you i said today i said the sacrifice you make that will connect you to your epa of destiny may the lord place you on your heart i said today the offering you will give the seed you will sow that will bring that will bring about your breakthrough i said today may the lord place in your hand in the name of
Lord Jesus. I say, may your airport of destiny may he locate you. I say, I prophesy. Somebody pray this morning that my airport of destiny will appear and locate you in this season of this fasting and prayer. Somebody pray that prayer. It does not matter the country where you are. My sister, my brother, I say, your airport of destiny. I say, I want you to pray that prayer that this morning, that Father, let my airport of destiny appear and let him locate me in this season. I say, the airport of destiny, the person that God has placed your app in their hand. I pray today and I want you to pray. My brother, my sister, I want somebody to declare that I refuse to have problem with my airport of destiny, with my destiny airport. I refuse to have problem with my destiny airport. Your manager at work, it may be your destiny airport. I say today, your husband may be your destiny upper. Your children, they may be your destiny airport. I say today, my sister, your business partner, your friend, they may be your destiny airport. My sister, my brother, I want you to pray that prayer. I refuse. I refuse to have problem with the airport of my destiny. I say my destiny airport. In the name of Jesus, I prophesy and I decree today. I say nothing shall come between you and your destiny helper. In the name of Jesus, somebody decree and declare that Lord, let my divine favor, let your divine favor change the situation in my life for good. I said today, the divine favor of God that will connect you to your airport of destiny. The Shunammite woman, she was connected. She was connected to Elisha, the destiny helper. I said today, I say may the favor of God, may he turn you, I say from nobody to somebody. I say today, this woman, she was turned to somebody. I prophesy and I decree, may the fire of God, I say today, the fire of God, I say today, may he locate and destroy every anti-favor, every anti-favor power that is working against your destiny. I said today, the woman was favored. She was favored. She was favored. Every anti-favor power operating in your family, operating in your life, operating your business, in your career, I say in your workplace, I say today, they are destroyed by fire. They are destroyed. They are terminated. I pray my brother, my sister, I pray this day for you. And I say any, every anti-favor, every anti-favor power that is operating in your life, that will not allow you to connect your miracle. I say today, they are terminated by the fire of the Holy Ghost. Somebody pray. Pray this morning. Any eyes that sees you, that shall favor me. I want you to pray that prayer. That any eyes that sees me, they shall favor me. They shall favor me. They shall favor me. They shall favor me. When the woman saw Elisha, Elisha was favor. Elisha was favor. The Shunammite woman and the household, when they lay eye on Elisha, Elisha was favor. I want somebody pray this morning. I said today, in this fasting period, in this season, my father, my father, somebody pray that any eye that sees me shall favor me. I say in your workplace, you shall be favor. Your application for visa, your application for immigration, I said they shall be favored in the name of Jesus. The application you make, I say for that employment, they shall be favored. My brother, my sister, somebody pray that prayer that any eye that sees me, they shall favor me. I say somebody pray, somebody pray. I join my faith with your faith this morning. And I say, my brother, my sister, any eye that sees you in that nation where you are, in your workplace, concerning your business, I say, any eye that sees you, they shall favor you. When they see your business name, they shall favor your business. I say, when they set eye on your application, you shall be favored. I say, somebody, you shall be favored. You shall be favored. You shall be favored. Somebody pray. Somebody pray and decree that you, my legs, receive the anointing to walk me into my divine favor somebody pray make a decree over your leg that you my legs i say receive the anointing to walk me into my divine favor elisha elisha was he walked into his favor in the name of jesus so my brother my sister i want you to pray that favor begin to pray make a decree over your leg i say today that father i 
I say, may your leg, may he walk you into your divine favor. May you, when you encounter favor, I say today, may he walk you into your divine favor. I say, may the blood of Jesus, may he deliver, I say, your destiny helper from every cage of darkness. I say today, may the blood of Jesus, may he deliver. The Bible say we overcame by the blood of the Lamb and the word of our testimony. My sister, my brother, I say this morning, may the blood of Jesus, may he deliver every destiny helper every helper of your destiny i said that i've been caged by darkness i said this morning somebody make that pronouncement make that pronouncement over your destiny helper that they will be delivered from every darkness i say somebody pray somebody make that decree make that decree this morning that father that lord bless me so that i can be a blessing to the poor to the orphan to the widow my sister my brother i want you to pray that prayer that father bless me indeed that i will be a blessing to offer i will be a blessing to the poor i will be a blessing to the widow my sister my brother i want you to pray that prayer somebody pray that prayer i said that pray that prayer elisha was a blessing to that woman lee gabba sat there that woman was a blessing to elisha i want you to pray that prayer that father bless me indeed this morning father throughout these 21 days of fasting and prayer i said the miracle morning that will turn around your financial blessing i said today may you receive my brother may you receive my sister may you receive lead about satay somebody pray pray this morning that father i shake out every disfavor from my life i shake it out i say somebody i want you to shake out shake it out of your body every spirit of disfavor begin to command them to leave your body i say this morning father i shake out every disfavor or pretty in my life or pretty in my family operating my workplace father i say concerning my applications father i pray i decree every spirit of this favor i shake them out i shake them out i shake them out in the name of jesus somebody pray every weekend in my foundation i say every weekend in your foundation i say against your destiny helper that is push pushing your destiny helper away i say today somebody decree they are terminated they are terminated they are terminated every wicked foundation in your life that is that is pursuing your destiny helper i said today they are terminated they are paralyzed somebody pray somebody pray every evil cloud that is covering your destiny helper from locating you i said this morning we command them to shift in the name of Jesus. i said this morning i say i command somebody command every evil cloud covering your destiny helper your destiny helper from locating you i said today they are shifted 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 i say by fire by fire the bible speak in verse 32 when elisha came into the house there was a child lying dead on his bed and he went in therefore the bible say and shut the door behind him with the two of them and pray to the lord the bible speak in verse 34 the bible say when he went up and lay on the child and put his mouth on his mouth his sight on his eyes and his hand on his hand and stretched himself out on the child and the flesh of the child became warm the bible say he returned and walked back forth in the house and again went up and stretched out himself on him then the child sneezed seven times and the eyes of the child opened the bible says Lee Gabba Shatea in verse 36 then he called Giazi and said call the Shunammite woman so he called her and when she came in to him he picked up your son and he said to her pick up your son my brother my sister i am praying for you lipora satea i say your destiny epa that will liberate you that will restore your joy i said today may you be connected 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 i say today as elisha restore the joy of this woman i say may your joy be restored i say today i say in these 21 days may your joy be restored i say may your
your joy be restored in the name of Jesus. The destiny helper that will restore your joy, that will restore your promotion. I said that will give you the job. I said today, may you be connected, may you be connected, may you be connected. That destiny helper that will approve your papers. I said today, may you be connected, may you be connected. I said today, that destiny helper that will approve your visa. I said today, may you be connected, may you be connected as you go this morning, my brother, my sister. I prophesy and I decree. I say, may your joy, may your joy be, may your joy be restored, may your joy be restored, may your joy be restored. I say that Dennis Lee Epa, may you restore your joy in the name of Jesus. As you go, my brother, as you go, my sister. I prophesy and I say that special miracle that will open your door to glory. I say today, may you begin to walk in it. I say that special miracle for divine exhortation, that special miracle for divine honor, that special miracle that will cause you to increase in every area of your life that special miracle that will bring to you an abundance of grace I say may you be connected this morning the extraordinary miracle the miracle that will bring success that special miracle that will take you to a place of victory I say today I prophesy and I say this morning my brother my sister as you go today I say may today may it be your day your day of increase may it be your day your day of divine faith May it be your day, your day of new beginning. My sister, my brother, I say today, may it be your day, your day of success, your day of victory. I say this morning, the special miracle in the name of Jesus that will make your joy to flow on in that. I say today, may you be connected. Somebody be connected. The special miracle that will increase your peace. I say today, that will make, allow your peace to flow on in that. I say this morning, I say may you encounter, may you encounter, be connected be connected I say somebody be connected I decree today and I say the special miracle that will launch you into unusual favor unusual favor unusual favor concerning your finances I say that miracle money that miracle job that miracle baby that miracle husband that miracle wife that miracle promotion I say receive I prophesy the special miracle that will bring about total restoration in your life my sister my brother be connected be connected be connected i prophesy and i decree today i say be connected be connected be connected be connected in the name of jesus christ of nazareth so shall it be in jesus name amen 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 in jesus name me gabara zateya kabahandi neroske den penokuriatia elila razateya kabashata handi i say so shall it be for you in the name of jesus christ of nazareth my brother my sister if this prayer this morning has blessed your spirit has blessed your soul before you leave i want to encourage you to please like the prayer and leave your faith comment and as you do so god will bless you more and more i say the special miracle you desire you shall see to the glory of the father in the name of jesus maybe today is your very first time of connecting with this prayer i want to know i want you to know my sister my brother that nothing acts by accident what the lord has commanded i say i know it shall be done in your life in the name of jesus i want to encourage you to please i want you to join us in this fasting and prayer today is the 14 of our fasting and prayer and i know the king of glory the lord of lord he will do something awesome there shall be double perfection in your life in the name of jesus we fast from 12 midnight to 6 p.m on a daily basis and as you join us i know god will answer every petition of your life in the name of jesus christ of nazareth my brother my sister i want to remind you all that on friday is our special breakthrough service for everyone trusting god for their own husband and their own wife my sister my brother if you know of anyone in your family amongst your friends that are trusting god believing god for for marital breakthrough i want you to direct them and connect them with this meeting and i know on friday midnight they are, i said their life shall never remain the same the king of king the lord of lord it will touch their situation it will change their life for good in the name of jesus they shall be blessed to the glory of the father and i know that greater things and great things shall happen in your life in the name of jesus god bless you this morning as you go today i say the special miracle you desire the lord will release into your hand in jesus name amen amen in jesus name god bless you